What is up guys? It's Contendo XTG. Today I'm going to be showing you how to catch a hot pot in Prodigy. And also to answer a question. Is the hot pot really hard to catch? So so first you're going to go to Bonfire Spire, Spear, whatever. So once you go here, you should see that this part is covered in lava. That's what you want. Because, if you go over here, this part has to be covered in lava too. That's what you want also. So first you have to go in here, and battle these two monsters so you can have um, more space. So I'll see you after this. Alright, now that you've, um, now that you have battled both of the monsters, in order to get this to be lava, you're going to have to go over here and flip this switch. So what happens when we flip the switch is that this we can't access since there's no lava. Th this rocky part right here we can't climb onto or do anything. So what you're going to have to do is press this switch so it's going to be green now. That's what you have to do to get this into lava. Now, once you've done that, you have to go onto the lava with the hot walkers if you completed if you've completed bonfire spear. And you have to go over here. And where the Bernoud is is where the hot pot is going to be. Now you have to reload, reload, and what reloading does is that it reloads the sprites, which also means it's going to reload the pets. So what you have to do, so when you reload the pet, you get the pet that you want. Also, in this case, hot pot. So you're gonna have to keep reloading until you find a hot pot. All right, guys. Finally, it took like ten minutes. It's not that hard. You can actually find a hot pot here, just right there. All right, so let's battle this big guy. So I actually, I actually just caught one and its hearts are pretty good. <laughs> okay. Yeah, so let's battle this. Okay. So, um, the Contendo XDG crew for the top 10, we have now put a date, and that would be November 6th. So, stay tuned for our top 10 coming out. Also, make sure to like and subscribe, because if you guys subscribe, we'll make even better Prodigy content. And who knows, maybe we'll start the Mario Kart content a little early. So, really excited for that. Now... Let's rescue this pet. Alright, Hot Pot has been caught. And since there's a second pet, I guess we're gonna battle it. Alright, so I have defeated the Burnoot. And let's get out of here before another pet regenerates. Alright, let's go to Limp Light Town. And let's read the stats of Hot Pot. I have two now. So, Hot Pot's pet ID, um, and the pet ID is this number right here. It's a, for, for example, Pico is number 16. Um, Hot Pot's ID is actually 45. So let's go over here. 45. It is said that if you knock a Hot Pot over, it becomes an overturned turtle and can't get up on its own. And its stats has a lot of hearts than power, but it has decent power. And it the element is fire. So hi, hi. What can I get Oh my gosh. Anyway, so the question is, is it hard to catch a hot pot? And my answer would be no, really. It's not that hard to catch a hot pot. Like I showed you, um you just have to go to that place and flip the switch and you have to reload the and then once you get to that area over there now that the lava is 
now that the lava is over there, um, you can just, sorry, let me rephrase that. So once you get to the, so all you have to do is press the switch and go over to that lava filled area. And it doesn't take you that long to reload, which also reloads the sprites to find a hot pot. So, um, that's finding a hot pot in Prodigy. It's not that hard. I'm saying it right now. It is not hard to catch a hot pot. So, guys, make sure to like and subscribe because you never know. If you, subs if you guys subscribe and we see more subscribers, then we may be doing our Mario Kart content early. So, make sure to like and subscribe, and we'll see you next time.